We often hear of that ominous three-syllable word in science fiction novels and movies, but what is entropy? And what does the heat death of the universe have to do with it? What is entropy anyway? Well, formally speaking, entropy is the measure of energy that is unavailable to do work. This is often interpreted as the measure of the degree of disorder in a system. A system, say, this mug of green tea, has a certain degree of disorder, in other words, entropy, associated with it. As the energy from the hot mug of green tea disperses into the surroundings, the irreversible change in energy increases the entropy of that system. The change of entropy in a process can dictate how spontaneous a process is. If the process results in a positive change in entropy, then we can say that the process is spontaneous. But if the process results in a negative change of entropy, then we can say that the process is not spontaneous. Picture this. Imagine you're in your bedroom. At the moment, it looks really neat. But after some time, you'll find that your room is an absolute mess. Your bed is unmade, your clothes are on the floor, your books and papers are just scattered everywhere. You can say that the degree of disorder in your room increased. In other words, the entropy of your bedroom increased. This is a spontaneous process. You didn't really do anything to make your bedroom look that messy. But it sure is a lot of hard work to keep it in order. I can hear what you're thinking. Why do I have to learn about entropy anyway? Well, the concept of entropy is key to understanding the second law. No, not the Muse album. The second law of thermodynamics. Simply put, if no energy enters or leaves an isolated system, the entropy of that system increases. If we consider the universe as an isolated system, the universe will continue to gain entropy as energy is dispersed throughout. Now, not scary or anything, but this is where we panic. Because when the universe is at maximum entropy, it may collapse in what is called the heat death of the universe, also known as the Big Freeze. Not convinced? Earlier, we learned that energy disperses throughout a system or into its surroundings, and that that change increases its entropy. Taken to the most logical extreme, there exists a theoretical state of the universe where energy has simply been spread out everywhere. Everything in the universe will be the same super cold temperature and there would be nothing to shake things up. But I don't think that will be any time soon. In the meantime, I'd better drink my tea before it gets cold.